Still getting set up. Yep. I apologize. I have barely been sleeping. So I hope you guys like the highly professional yawns. Ooh, we got a Wario on deck. Okay. Yeah, neither of their tags match their tags. That's always good. Ooh, Wario coming out hot with a parry and then a pretty clean string. And then Cloud hits him twice, and they're even. Nice. Yolo upbeat, the favorite of the sortie. Getting him out of trouble and doing work. Oh, nice. It's nice to start seeing Clouds use that right away. I know they don't have long to hang on to it, but it's really cool to just, like, see this huge bomb just ready to go off instead of just, oh, yeah, he could do that to me at any time. I like it. I like the changes to Cloud. Wish he could drift more after his up B, especially considering what some of the other sorties get. But hey, what are you going to do? Oh. Good DI. Wario is ready to go. But yeah, good shoulder charge. Might be able to kill Cloud, or at the very least, set him up for a pretty easy game. Okay. Cloud's got a limit on deck again. Wait, no, no, no. Nice. Just throws out a blade beam. Better than losing it. Makes sense. We got CRB sitting back down. And that was an unfortunate I've heard about SD. pretty good. Okay. So, let's see. He's on Joy-Cons, but it's working so far. I just feel bad for all the sticks he's going to have to buy every couple of months. Yeah, because yeah. those degrade really fast. They do. They're disgusting. I use the Joy-Cons primarily as my controller for everything except for Smash, and they break terribly fast. Is Thanks. replacing them a pain? It is. You have to take the entire thing all the way down to the bones. Oh, that's it's the last thing that comes out in disassembly. That sucks. It is. I uh, can repair them, and it only takes me about 30 minutes. Nice play, Bean. Uh, but it's so annoying that what I've started doing is I will just buy brand new Joy-Cons and then swap out the back panels and then keep the new ones and uh, have Nintendo deal with that when they get it back. Because I've gone through four left ones and two right ones. Huh. Yep. It makes sense that you go through the left ones faster. Yeah, yeah, you're using that stick all the time. This is really even. It um, is. C Sharp is, like, a good player. So to see a Cloud do this well against him is kind of crazy. Yeah. yeah, especially against uh, Wario. Yeah, oh. this matchup seems like garbage. Yeah, you think. Well, he's not ledge trapping. Oh. I don't know why. That was a great decision. Nice. Better than losing it. That air dodge was really good, though, too. Yeah. Yeah, he wanted it. Oh. Good bite. That might. Ki no, not quite. Not quite. Cloud's still kind of heavy. Yeah. Oh, that'll do That's it, though. That's going to do it, though, yeah. F tilt's meaty as hell. F yeah, F tilt's, F -tilt's magic. Up yet, a shield's so good. I think yeah. it's like frame 12. Oh, that's going to do it. Yeah. Wow, that hitbox goes just all the way back to his feet. It's really big, yeah. yeah. Good tech chase. That's one of the scariest things against Wario. You get up aired once and you think you're going to get up aired again. And yes. He just, it then looks, he just resets his combo. Well, it looks like he has full waft on deck, too, so he. Yeah, you're terrified. He can seal the deal at pretty much any point now. Okay, good play, B. I played my round two already. I wasn't on stream. I don't know. This is I the first here. game. He just plays slow. It took him a while to get set up. Oh. Great bite. Yep, gets in there, eats some cloud. He's landing with downer kind of a lot. I'd I'm, uh, Although, C Sharp was not a Smash 4 player, so I doubt he knows how to deal with cloud very well. Yeah. Well, he is easier to deal with here, though, at least. And I'm sure he overheard at least enough of it. <laughs> Wow. Okay. I was wow. With say, punish waft. That's yeah. What, that was really good. I felt like the waft had to be coming. That he'd start fishing for it one way or the other, and there it was. Death by sulfur poisoning. <laughs> Maybe you should have been from a better Final Fantasy cloud. All right. They're going through the rules. Forrest uh, finally got little rule sheets. I sent him all the information compressed on a simple sheet, and was like, what I'm just going to print them out. And then he took three weeks to print them out. 
Oh. Yeah, it was nice. It was high quality. That's cool. Yeah, but at least they're in color now. And he formatted them slightly different. Slow man. Oh, he got them all, like, nicely printed out. Yeah. That's like a, what, Google drawing? Or just, yeah, I'm not sure. Just uh, probably word and portrait. What are you looking at me for? In uh, landscape. I'm scared now. Used to be a professional. Oh, no, used to be a people person. Long ago. Now it's gone. And hey, Adrian, can you hit battle? Forrest just ran away. All right. Ooh. Back at it. Yeah, Wario coming so out strong. Yeah, I feel like Wario definitely likes a smaller space more than Cloud does. Way easier to hang on to the neutral and keep the pressure up. C sharp not being able to space oh. those aerials around his down air very well right now. Getting rid of Blade Beam with the bike was smart or a cool accident. I wonder if he could eat Blade Beam. That was interesting. Yeah, he's. He's gone. I, I can feel the battlefield is like his home. He loves this. He's got all the spacing perfectly planned out. Up air is still huge. Yeah, it is still huge. At least huge. to the sides. It is hard to come down on cloud. Wario's new dash tag is amazing. Interesting decision. Yeah. But I like it. Screw your bike. Oh! That, that shield poke? If that shield poke, that was sick as... That was sick. Or maybe he got the uh, time extension on the hitbox from the... Uh, oh, that would make sense. From hitting the bike, and then he dropped it, and then it hit him. If that was intentional, that's big brain. I feel like we've come to a point now where it's just like, hey, I see Wario's bike and Wario's near it, I should hit it. Like, that's just how everybody feels, is hit the bike when they're by it. Maybe it'll hit them. He might have just wanted to get rid of bike and it was a happy accident. Yeah, it could have yeah. been that too. See bike, hit bike. Although now that Wario is, like, can't recover without it, I feel like you almost want to, like, save the bike. Leave the bike on stage and then you force him off do. stage. Yeah. Because as soon as the bike is gone, his recovery is mediocre. Yeah. Well, He's super gimpable. Oh, that was an interesting... Wow. That was a really good parry, and then, wait, I can't punish him yet, and then punish. Ooh, that was really good. It's kind of a shame it didn't connect. Yeah, he had something there, and he lost it. Oh, nice. We got Great all the parryos from Mario here. The second hit just didn't come out. He timed it poorly. Okay. Oh. He's blowing his jump early. Don't do it. Oh, and now, okay. Back in there. Dash attack. Yeah. Dash attack's so good. The old shoulder charge. It's a pretty cool move. It is. I'm glad they did that. Oh, oh she'll, she'll poke. poke, yep. That's going to pull that stock off, but... Wario's still got Waft on deck, and he doesn't need to do too much more damage. I mean, it's Cloud, too. You can really just throw him off stage and yeah. hit him. But See, sure, kind of mashing that aerial button. Yeah. Ooh. Blade Beam caught him a little tiny bit. One little, little touch. Okay. Does get a punish. Nice. React was up to him very well. Oh, I feel like here. yeah, all these these bike pulls are a little risky. Yeah, they definitely are. He's he's got a big sword. Definitely kind of a good idea though to like throw it. Yeah. It gives you like a great position, especially oh. like if it lands next to them or they shield it, because then yeah. they can't do tilts anymore. They have to jump or shield. Oh, and that'll do it. That will do it. All right. Game three. Yeah, so we're one to one. Oh. Okay, moving on to game three here. their time thinking it through.
All right. Back into game three. Here we go. Town and city. The stage is so good. It makes me really sad that people tried to remove it. I This stage is great. Everyone yeah. wants to ruin the stage list forever. That's the moral of the story. You give a little and you lose a lot. Like, I understand getting rid of Lilat. That's... Nope. That doesn't make sense in this game. It does, though. It doesn't. The ledges are just as bad. The ledges are not just as bad. They definitely are. They are not. They're pretty bad. They are not. I'm biased. My character doesn't work on this stage. None of my characters work on this stage. I hate tiny stages. I still think there should be some I little mean, stages. I mean, my character just doesn't grab ledge. Like ever. Which character? Lucina. Lucina grabs yeah, ledges? Yeah, she's... No. I not there. I don't have trouble snapping ledges on Lilat with Marth, and I play enough Marth to not feel bad about it. It sucks he if comes you, really close. It sucks if you get stuck under it, but it's more of something you have to consider than something that's horrible. Especially when you're backwards. Oh, well, yeah. Their, their, their backwards thing doesn't work on most stages, but like especially on Lilat. Yeah, but that's, I mean, that's tough for them all the time. That's tough for a lot of people. Yeah. But they're definitely not like magical like they used to be, where you'd slip through the stage, yeah. or literally like touch it and then not grab it. Speaking of recoveries, they can't grab from the back. Cloud. Yeah. Getting get or. He's just he's just doomed. He's paying he's paying for what he did to doubles in Smash Four. He definitely is. That was a monstrosity. And Bayonetta will be paying for what she did for the rest of her life. <laughs> They're just going to replace her with an Astral Chain character. They're going to be like, you know what, you guys? We're sorry. Astral Chain is in. Bayonet is out. None of you guys like her anyway. Wow. I wouldn't be opposed. It'd be kind of cool. It'd be kind of cool to have just gun ice climbers. Gun climbers. <laughs> this is what I want so bad now. Oh my god, two people like shooting. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah. Oh. They're going to Did he burn it. the jump? That's yeah. it. Wow. Bye, Cloud. He's really been edge guarding him way better at game three. Yeah, well, and it's, I mean, it's Cloud. It's and important. With aerial momentum in this game and how you can move in the air, all you have to do is watch for the jump. As soon as you see the jump, go. Go He's touch dead. him. Yeah. Oh, and he's got Waft fully charged on deck, too. That was a good combo. Yeah, Cloud's definitely making an effort, managing to keep him off. Oh. Okay. Good. Back here. And, oh, no. Blade Beam. Okay. Good Blade Beam. Yeah, I like that choice. one, actually. I feel, like, I feel like it's worth fishing when you're down like this. It's worth fishing for for finishing touch as, like, the get-up read. Oh, nice. We're just I mean, if you're down to, like, like, 150 and they're at 40, and you think you're going to neutral get up, yeah. Yeah. For sure. Like, your odds of winning the rest of the game are... Well, it's, it's just... Cloud with limit is hard to get up against too because he might. He might just kill you. Yeah, he might kill you with finishing touch. He has uh, side B, uh, and uh, well, pretty much just those two on ledge. Wow, it bounced back on Cloud somehow. Okay, blade beam. Ooh, that was so good. Really okay. playing her patient now. Yeah. More bite? No chances. Oh, no oh, punish for that really. air dodge. Okay. Cloud's not out of this yet. The Bad bike. spacing. Yeah. That could cost him. Could, but it didn't. Yeah. He's still kind of in like frame disadvantage right now. He lost stage for it. He yeah. It's all like after effects. Now he's back to neutral. He has advantage. He's Man, it's gone. <laughs> oh, that was really good. Oh, he saw okay. the bike was there and he just kind of figured, well, I have space. Okay. Oh. Close. He's, yeah, he starts to make a hole and then he just he gives up. He's, he's got the yips over there. He can turn this around though. Oh my god, that was so good. The patience. There we go. He's got Lumen on deck. Oh, he was fishing for that too. Yeah, I was ready for it. Okay, that's something. That was that was really good. Yeah, you can act Save really fast out of it, so. It's not very punishable, but yeah. I'm not sure what it is like on shield. Okay, that back here. Might take it, yeah. Cloud doing cloud stuff. That was close. That was really close. That was a great set. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah. Wario. Eight times. I didn't catch the full hop. Ouch. Yeah. 
Why not? I don't know. That's dumb. Maybe. Life is tough. I read it every time. Timing's off, dude. It's hard. Well, I'm gonna take a little he break. Does. Here. <laughs> I said that earlier, yeah. <laughs> like. I can play Cloud against you at home. But you don't you don't edge your guard very well. Yeah. You, you can lose neutral like seven out of like six or seven out of eight times. What? No, it doesn't kill you at zero anymore. If you don't have your jump, it will. But. Like, until you know how to gimp cloud, like, 9 out of 10 times, you're gonna lose. It's, it's hard. But as soon as you do, the matchup's free as hell. Free. Any character that is good edge guarding, and then it's kind of free. It's not that bad. His nair's gone. I'll have to worry about his bear. It's easier now. Fair isn't that. Fair isn't that hard to deal with. You can parry run up grab I'm pretty sure. No I'm in. I won my round one. I mean I mean I had to buy it yeah. TPP mid level player privilege. Mid level player privilege. Yeah. I'm actually low level. I'm terrible. I'm garbage. I got lucky. He he didn't want to kill himself, but he but he did, but he did. Literally anything. You you could have upbeat. You'd have been fine. <laughs> That shirt say what I think it says? Is that stream friendly? I'll heck you so hard. <laughs> I wish. He's wearing the pants for it. Like the big cargo pants or jeans shorts. Large. That was kind of fast on the spot. <laughs> hey, chat. How are y'all doing? So you're trying Diddy, Otis? Why are you playing Diddy? Character's bad. Backwards. Speaking of frame one swap, we'll be seeing uh, quite a lot of that. Get out of jail free card. It's pretty good. See Adrian's.
perfect beard. Shoutouts to our apparent sponsors, Health Matters. Didn't know we had sponsors. That's dope! Let's go Health Matters. Muscular therapy. It's honestly sick. Do your muscles need therapy? Health Matters. When did the sponsorship come in? What? Health Matters. Oh, I don't know. When did that happen? I don't know. That's cool. I haven't seen that. Forrest is in game, so we can't harass him about it. We're <laughs> <laughs> actually doing the striking and everything. CRB's over here holding his own hands. I don't know what that was. I don't know, I just saw his shirt and I saw like the ice cream and I saw a bite out of it and it was like, ah. I don't know, I just did it with my hand. Just wanted ice cream? That I was kinda the whole thing. actually. I, I haven't kinda, had ice cream in a bit. Kinda always do. Gotta be a typo. <laughs> and then I get to like a place where I can order ice cream. And then I decide to be responsible and not get ice cream. And it's like kind of a mistake. I feel like honest. you're skinny enough that you can just eat all the ice cream. I could. You got a couple of years of that I'm left. I'm trying to put on like healthy weight. Well then do exercise. I do. Get the muscles. I do. Stop like taking Adderall. To clean too. Stop taking Adderall. That's what it is. What? Adderall? Yeah? Yeah, stop taking it. I d what? Oh. I couldn't, I literally, I couldn't even build muscles until after I got off of it. I, I don't take it right now. I used to be prescribed like a long time ago. Ah. Yeah, it took me a long time. And then my metabolism got terrible in my late 20s. And now I got this. Right now? Sick. Oh, CRB's out of here. No more weird life advice. From a hot fizz. Yeah, I literally used to be 90 pounds up through high school. Now I'm not. <sighs> Pretty exciting stuff. Oh. That almost worked. That was pretty scary. Oh, wow. Wow. This is a lot of harassment from Ivysaur. Right out the gate. Okay. Bowser had him on the edge. Down again. Gotta not do that. Oh, yep, that tail, that tail hurts. I don't think I have 42 on. I feel like I, I, Ivysaur could still be working, but this is working too. Bowser's slow too. Esports. That almost did it. Well, it kind of almost did it. That is a bad throw now. That will do it. Tail hurts. Got the turtle on deck. Little turtle versus big turtle. Here we go. Bowser is really going to want to start putting the hurt on. Ideally on the turtle as fast as he can, because that's the one that dies easy. Oh! Accidental air dodge after the hit. Okay. That was a good dash back grab. And now he's putting the hurt on with some up airs. Missed with the uppy. Oh, I think he was expecting a very different DI. Back air's gonna do it. Bowser's still at a pretty significant disadvantage. I was literally just gonna say, I'm suspecting that we're gonna see some YOLO side Bs from Adrian's Charizard. And I suspect there's another one coming. Oh, nope, goes for the dare. Nice, clean KO. Well, not if we're, yeah. 
Yeah, and then the other person won, and then the, so. Yeah, and then the winner picks? Really. Yeah. I got to the Delilah. The winner picks the stage. Uh, this is your life now. Getting into game one here, game two, and they are both sticking apparently. Mind if I tag him? What's that? Mind if I yeah, go for it. Sweet. I have no clue how good I'm going to be at commentating, but I can try. Ooh. Yeah, you know, small weekly. Yeah. Oh, small thing. you were loud. We're going to pull you out there a little bit. Talk. Thank you. There Hello. We go. Testing. That's hey. Right. Loud guy. There we go. Yeah, I'm very loud. That better? <laughs> yeah, I think All that's right. good. Yo, what up? Hi. All right, so we got, uh, who do we got right now? We got Nuh-uh and Winro. Oh, yeah, it's up there. Nuh-uh <laughs> doing, uh, doing Squirtle and Winro doing Bowser. Yeah. Game one went and pretty tough for Bowser. He's having a little bit, it's going a little better for him with all this extra space to work with so far. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. He likes punching that little turtle. And it's like, it's like Squirtle's going to come up on his butt. Oh, shit. Even at 60, not nah, sticking to Squirtle though. Yeah, Windrow's got a pretty good percentage lead right here. He does, and, and a, a good hard hit will kill Squirtle just right yeah. out, right out of here. Yeah, you think he want he'd want to go out for for Charizard or at least Ivysaur at this point. Yeah, just a little, just a little more extra weight to oh. deal with. His Bowser hits like a, a freaking truck. He does. Uh, so, but no, he's he's sticking to the turtle. He maybe he just wants to work on the. Just wants to work on the turtle. That makes sense. They're still pretty yeah. even. There's still, there's still decent stuff you can do with Squirtle at yeah. least. Uh, but I think just with this matchup. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he's up a game, and Squirtle smash attacks do hurt pretty good. Yeah. You can tell, especially with that stock that he took from Bo from Winrow. Yeah. Uh, when it, and uh, uh is solidifying his lead. Yeah, man. Just stack a decent amount of extra yeah, but percent. If, yeah, but if he doesn't switch soon enough, he is going to... He's going to lose that, lose his first stock soon enough, and whoa, that'll do it. That will absolutely wreck. But he's got Ivy Sword now. I wonder if he's gonna stick to them for a while. Seen. Oh, tough guy. Yeah. Tough guy. I think this might be, this might be a better set for. This might be a better matchup for Winrow. Maybe. I'm not sure because, because Ivy Sword doesn't Ivy Sword have a little more. Yeah. A little more of a hitbox. Like sure. just a bigger body, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Oh, good parry, Ooh. good punish too. Winro closing the gap and taking taking a minor percentage lead there, and he has to. Yeah, he's bringing out Charizard at this point. Yeah. There's no way he can. Yeah, game's pretty much even at this point. Yeah. Charizard in disadvantage. Wow. Oh. Oh. Yeah. And couldn't recover from the from that Batista bomb. <laughs> so bomb. dead even. Bringing out the Squirtle again. Fire is weak to water. Oh, yeah. So do looks like they're still sticking to neutral, but Squirtle gets a good, a good grab. What do we have here? Looks like they're looks like they're really just trying to find one little opening, and it looks like Winner managed to get that. Yeah, both playing real cautious here. Yeah, because because for not uh, if he. If he goes in too aggressively, he could he could end up getting losing his lead and getting that getting uh, lost at one row. <laughs> Bowser's spiked on stage animation is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I I honestly feel like Ivysaur was the choice here, but I know he's really comfortable Charizard, so this could definitely work too. Yeah, well if you I just well, feel like Ivysaur's disjoints gave him a lot of potential for harassment and projectiles. Charizard still has some good disjoints and good kill, good kill power. So we'll see what happens here. Yeah, He's definitely fishing a little bit. A little bit. I'm expecting either the Yolo up B or the Yolo side B, the the classic Adrian special. Day. Yeah. I think at this oh, point no he punish, knows though. that he's anything can mess him up it. like that. Yep. And Winro making a sod comeback with Bowser. With Bowser. Oh my God. <laughs> Really saw a job on Winrow's part, so you think he's still going to stick with uh, Pokemon Trainer? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I think he's just going to dick around less with Squirtle in the beginning. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, I think a better 
mixing up his Pokemon better would help him out a lot more. Cause, but he didn't do, he didn't do, he didn't do too bad with Squirtle uh, for a stock though. Ended up getting a you know kill off of him. What? Yeah, it looks like they're still sticking with Pokemon Trainer. So game three, game to take it and. <coughs> oh. Okay, All right, so Lilat, Lilat party time. Yeah, we're gonna. See. This could be. This could be advantageous wow. for. Uh, for. Uh, I'm not sure. Who do you think? Who do I you mean, think would have the b advantage in here? You think Bowser? Nah, I picked it. And I'm assuming Na'a wants it just so he has a tighter space to hold Bowser to and some platforms to harass him on. Because it is, it's tough for Bowser to deal with landing on platforms. For yeah. Sure. Yeah, because he can still. Uh, he can oh, st I bet. And Ivy Swords projectiles are super annoying on Lilat. Yeah. And that little thin, little tiny thin section of stage makes it really easy to catch people with there. Yeah, but it wow. doesn't matter That'll too much. It. You managed to get. Wow, duck taunts. This is yeah. a tournament. You can do the full-on D-pad <laughs> taunts like a gentleman. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, but he goes for straight up for the T-bag. Bold man, Winrow. Bold of you. <laughs> okay, so, so... Getting him off stage of Squirtle. Okay, oh, Ready that's going to do it, yeah. Ooh, up air. Yeah, gets the setup. Gonna get him and switching off the... To this, back to Squirtle. I don't think that setup's actually true unless Bowser DI's like crap. Mm. But I guess that is. He, did he DI right then? I must have. I don't think so. I think that he was either pulling in or pulling up. Alright. Yep. Alright, sounds good. Well, I'm Looks gonna like dip out. Alright. Alright, have fun with the rest of this match. <laughs> There you go. We got Forrest hocking in over here. Yep. He looks a little sad. Nope. That's my concentration face. I think that's your tired face. I'm always tired. Oh, good. Yeah, please mute both my ears. Oh, wait. Now I can hear. Now I can hear. Can you hear? Yeah, I can hear. I can hear. Okay. Perfect. There we go. All right. So, what do we got here? Game three. Two stocks apiece. Not coming on with the drop down up beat give himself stage and we're seeing potential ledge guard goes with oh, there not dare oh how the, the i literally saw red sparks he that must have hit the stage a second that was time. a tech that was a tech but i saw the, the you can't tech sparks i think he must have bounced on the stage twice oh weird oh i love the tea oh, bag that's gonna do it that's not gonna do it oh my god charizard's a big boy he is i would have loved if he would have caught the ground or the jump up with that yeah. <laughs> oh he's caught I really thought no one had him there. That's going to do it. Back throw. Oh, my God. These are big, beefy These boys. Are big, but big boys. Yeah. Stuffs them with the fair. Good good stuff. These guys kind of just uh, taking turns, hitting each other off. I don't see either one really getting a super big advantage here. Now, honestly, oh, that's going to do it. Oh, great parry. Nice. Nice parry punish. I feel like at that percentage that you want to make some space and go back to uh, Ivysaur and projectile harass for as much extra credit as you can. But well, I don't know, because Squirtle has the ability to just essentially outframe everything that Bowser does. Oh, yeah. I meant pre-death, right right before okay. he died. Gotcha. Uh, just because he's then you have the projectiles to harass with. But, yeah. Yep. Yeah, I mean, Squirtle makes sense coming back. Right. Stack and all the, the damage. Yeah. Oh, that's oh, going to do it. Yeah. Snap. Okay. No, oh, that's uh, not going to do it. Whoa. Okay. I Thanks. was going for the score already. Thanks, 4.0 nerfs. Oh, great parry. Oh. Nice. Winrell getting these parries when he absolutely needs them. So looking good there. He might still be able to clutch this out. That throw not going to be doing Back. it. Oh. oh, air dodge, really? Oh. oh, so close. Very close. The perfect amount of harassment. They were both right there. He yeah. honestly, Bowser might have been able to do like up air and catch him. And, well, he probably wouldn't have been able to kill him though. No, that was a trade either way, bat in yeah. not his favor. It was actually perfect ledge defense by no -uh. he yeah. put himself just in the right spot to be able to guard that so yep and took it home.